Hey, what's up? What's up, bro? You getting your license this weekend? Yeah, Saturday. You're probably gonna fail. I hope not. I hope you do. Wow. Oh, so uh, you and Kaylin still going out tonight? Uh, yeah, I think so. I know you're talking to that guy, Kaylin. But... What are you talking about? I know you're talking about, Kaylin. Babe, why are you treating me like this? Why are you doing this to me? Who is this? I don't know! Like really bad words. Is he hitting you? Is he spitting at you? Talking? Being mentally abusive? There's something different. What's going on? Well, he's been hitting me lately. It's not. Are you being serious? Are you being real? Yeah. I think we need to go to the office. about something personal. Sure. Me and my boyfriend have been having issues lately. Tell me about these issues. Like, he's being, like, abusive. And, and I know that's not supposed to happen. Abusive in what ways? Like, the other day he slapped me across the face and he's been pushing me through the doors. And he slaps my books out of my hands and I know that's not supposed to happen. How long has it been going on? Just these last couple weeks. Okay. How old are you, Kayla? 17. 17. All right. So you're not an adult yet. So as a minor, I am obligated to kind of break confidentiality in this type of situation, which means that I'm going to have to most likely call home. Who do you live with? My mom. Your mom. All right. So I'm going to have to call your mom and let her know what's going on, and then I'm going to have to report it to Childline. What will happen with Childline is they will contact the local, the local branches of that and they'll be getting in touch with you in person um, to kind of assess what's going on from a more personal standpoint. If you have any marks or bruises or anything, they might take pictures. Um, they might ask you some more personal questions about the abuse. Um, but we would have to do that before we did anything else. Thank you. You're welcome.